Hey guys, Sam Walton from Tech Fusions here, and today we're going to be looking at the ice cream sandwich launcher on an Android device. So we'll be looking at the ice cream sandwich launcher, which is free from the Android market and works on most Android devices. I have tested it on the HTC Desire HD and the Samsung Galaxy S2. I don't know about other devices, you can just try it for yourself, it's free, don't take long to download, and you might as well try it. Okay, so if we go into the launcher now, uh, we'll click on menu, um, here it is, the ice cream sandwich launcher, click on this, and it just launches up, and as you can tell it's got um, the touch buttons just down here it's got the window one which you can just go to your window say if you wanted to go to browser just go on the browser and yeah stuff like that you just go straight to it it's really good um, got the home button this goes to home so if you was on enough screen just press the home button and it opens up all the pages and you can just go to whatever page you want okay and it's got the back button so um, if you're on this page, press the back button. This goes back to the normal, the one that you set as your home screen, which is this page in my case. And you can also put widgets on. You just hold down. Uh, as you can see, it's got shortcuts, widgets, folders, wallpapers, the ice cream sandwich wallpapers, and the launcher settings. So if we um, if we take a quick look at shortcuts. Uh, you can put all your shortcuts on if we have a quick look at widgets you got all your widgets there you can put it on um, if we try and move about a widget like you can just place it basically anywhere it don't give you that much of a restriction if we have a look at the other widgets um, it's got folders so we can add a folder if we have a look at the ice cream sandwich wallpapers um, this is the one that you see on the um, Galaxy Nexus which is coming out with the 4.0 ice cream sandwich but as you can see you can just have the um, launcher where it looks exactly the same and no one would know it is a really good launcher it's got all the backgrounds, I like the grass one that's nice the city one's pretty cool as well just set it as your wallpaper it also a good feature when you turn it landscape turns into landscape mode and you can just swipe across from there and look at all the applications that you've got on the home screen and yeah it's just a great launcher you know, I really like it and you can got quick access to the internet and to talk down here you can change them I think yeah you can just remove them now you can add different ones but I'm not going to do that at the moment if you click on the application button you can see all your applications you can scroll through them say if you wanted to open up music just click on music opens up press back goes straight back to the launcher and you can set this as your default launcher but at the moment I don't so when you press the home screen it will go back to this launcher but I don't have it set up at the moment as my home launcher I just got the normal touch with which comes with the Samsung Galaxy S2 which I really like but this is a great launcher it's very good and also the fact that it's free and it don't run with um, with Go Launcher or Launcher Pro it's a launcher in itself and I think it's really great it's a nice launcher it's nice and basic really um, I like the fact that you can turn it landscape so if you got a stand I've got like this little plunger thing which you just put on the back here and you can just stand it up oh, don't know what I pressed there um, and you can just swipe through it like that while having it stand up and if you're watching a movie you can go back then you can just text easy as well just like that so now was the review on the ice cream sandwich launcher I hope you liked it um, Please comment what you think of the launcher and if you will be downloading it. This was Sam Morton from Tech Fusions. Please like, comment and subscribe. Thanks.